All right, so now we got everything back together. Got the duct work back in, it's all masked up. The line set's back over here. Coils remounted, got the filter rack back in. Got all the electronics put back together. So the entire unit's put back together. So now to uh, go over one more time how the wiring works. So your two brown leads are your capacitor. And again, we're gonna use a five microfarad capacitor instead of a seven, so that way this is a one-fifth instead of a one-sixth with the motor housing we choose. So this is your line side or your common side of your power, and then these are your speed selectors. So this is medium low for one-fifth, uh, that's for cooling. Now in heating, if this was a gas furnace, you would put red on your heating side and cooling on your other side. But this doesn't have that, so it's, we're gonna cap that off. And then so of course, you have your medium high and your high speed for half horsepower. So, we'll go ahead and wire these up to where this will go to your line side of your power here. Okay, so that's your 120 and then this goes to your actual speed selector which comes off your relay right here this is what actuates the motor to turn on and off when there's a call for cooling and then uh, we'll go ahead and line our capacitor and just cap these off so stay tuned for startup